Good morning. We are going to start with a dry paper today and here I just want to doodle what we are going to draw. We are going to make flowers like this and birds that are these sh uh, shapes. You just add the body and then wings. They don't have to be perfect. <clears throat> but you will just shade. Uh, you will just create these with your white crayon. And they're very simple shapes. So I'll just show you here. I'm scattering the flowers here at the bottom and I'm trying to make many of them uh, in the bottom third of the paper and then I'm adding up to five birds don't make too many keep the middle part of your paper clear for Baldur the beautiful all right now you're going to wet it after you are finished with that step and you are going to start with lemon yellow and as you can see where we drew the crayon flowers those flowers pop out when you paint over it and so you have to use the crayons very very strongly so that they really block the paper up like this all right and then we are going to after putting Prussian blue of course we are going to use ultramarine blue for the sky and then the birds will appear in the sky now you might uh, like me see that some of the birds uh, look a bit odd you can use your sponge right away after painting to pick up some of the paint and shape your birds in the way that you like and add some clouds as well all right so we just used three colors so far and we just washed over the paper. The images were formed by the crayon we did before. Now we are going to draw uh, to paint Baldur himself with a dot of gold for his head. Don't make it too big because it's going to spread out. And carmine red clothes here. I'm just making a simple tunic, picking up some of the uh, paint that spread out a bit. And gold again for his hands. And vermilion for his hair here and then we add the beard and then pick up some of the vermilion again for his mouth and there you go Baldur the beautiful